Hey everyone! Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of batteries, specifically Tesla's new generation of the 4680 battery, which is making quite a splash. Recently, a detailed analysis of this battery, found in the Model Y, revealed innovative chemical changes. Just imagine, Tesla tweaked the secret formula of the battery to supercharge its performance. But before we uncover these changes, let's understand the reason behind this revolution. The first generation of the 4680, although promising, fell short in terms of performance, especially in charging speed and energy density. To make matters worse, Tesla faced difficulties in producing cathodes using its dry battery electrode DB, manufacturing process, a revolutionary technique that promised to reduce costs and production time but proved to be quite a challenge. The situation became even more tense when the inventor of the DB technique left the company last year. Despite some recent positive news, such as the announcement that the production of the 4680 is in full swing and that the battery can now power more than a thousand Cybertrucks per week, Tesla needed to solve the performance issues for the 4680 to become the ideal battery for its future cars. And that's when the magic happened. The second generation of the 4680 arrived with significant improvements. The main one was the change in battery chemistry, adopting NCMA, a powerful combination of nickel, cobalt, manganese, and aluminum. This new formula, with 82% nickel, 11% cobalt, 5% manganese, and 3% aluminum, promises to be the key to the 4680's success. Compared to the first generation, nickel and aluminum increased slightly, while cobalt decreased. This strategic change, adopted by several battery manufacturers, has a reason. Cobalt, although it improves battery life and safety, is expensive and involves complex ethical and environmental issues in its extraction. By reducing cobalt, Tesla cuts costs, embraces sustainability, and still keeps the battery's performance high. And there's more. The new anode of the 4680 Gen 2 is made of natural graphite doped with a touch of silicon. This addition, even though small, about 0.14%, makes a big difference, increasing the energy density and overall efficiency of the battery. But who will be the supplier of this new battery? The strongest bet is LG Chemistry. They are pioneers in NCMA chemistry and recently started building the largest cathode factory in North America. Coincidence? I think not. Additionally, there are rumors that Tesla has signed a multi-million dollar contract with LG for the purchase of 6 trillion electrodes, which reinforces this theory. If LG Chem is indeed behind Tesla's new battery, will the company finally be able to produce the 4680 on a large scale and at a reduced cost, as promised five years ago on Battery Day? Time will tell. But, for sure, this new generation of the 4680 promises to revolutionize the electric car market. And what do you think about this new battery? Leave your opinion in the comments, and let's discuss. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel to stay updated on everything about Tesla. See you next time.